My name's Simon Alsop, founder of iKeep. On a daily basis, we're helping business owners automate and stay on top of their compliance in their small business. Today, in the Building Wealth as a Business Owner series, we're helping them with various strategies on how they can build their personal wealth after building the value of their business. So we kick off today with the first lunch session with Chris Gray, the founder of Your Empire. And I've got David Kenny with us as well, who's a partner here at Hall Chadwick. The biggest thing I learned after Sky News doing like four or 500 interviews is, the main thing is, is it's supply and demand. If there's no more supply of a product and there's plenty of demand, prices go up. This is why I think residential versus commercial property or industrial property or getting into a business, you haven't got staff or stock or anything like that. So my portfolio probably takes me about an hour a month to look after because you just delegate out to property managers and they're all on 12 month leases and stuff. Opening up and, and developing more value, it comes back to working out what the systems are. I've never seen anyone sell a business and they say, show me the balance sheet. Show me what's on your balance sheet and I'll tell you what you're worth. Because what someone's buying is essentially the systems, the processes and the people and the mechanisms for how that ongoing regular income is generated each time that gets de-risked. So I think the key thing is really keeping things simple as possible. And I always like to refer to three things, which is getting the right product in front of the right customers with the right message and it all comes back to that. My name is Oliver, I run a medical recruitment business called Blueprint Medical. In its entirety, understanding how you, know, you can use your business and move into that sort of property sector, which hadn't been something that I'd really strongly considered before, and the ramifications of how best to do that, and we you know some of the some of the sort of tax side as well. It was, it was quite diverse in terms of the range of knowledge I got from it. There are a lot of things in there that I really took quite a lot from. Yeah. My name's Emma. I run a company called Accelerate Marketing. A lot of what they said today resonated with me about, you know, the media and there is a lot of hype and controversy around rate changes, if they will, if they won't. I think at the end of the day, you know, if you're looking long term, 20, 30 years, then what changes within two, three years, you know, if you can be stable and you can have the cash flow to help support yourself during that time, then, you know, you do want to look long term.